Lagos House is a hospice for children and young adults and that might sound a very sad place but actually it's not. So one of the things we do is to add experience and opportunities to people's lives who are often a little bit shorter than our own. The relationship between Helen Douglas House um, and the Barclay Homes, Oxford and Chilton offices is quite a unique and special one, but one that we, we, are very, we are very proud of and we cherish. We've been supporting Helen Douglas House now for over, over, 16. over 16 years. The thing that you notice when you, when you come here, it's an atmosphere that just almost overwhelms you about how positive things are, from the children particularly. You see the children and they are unbelievably positive about mm. their outlook. My name's Dylan and I'm 17 and I've got Duchenne muscle dystrophy. I've been coming to Helen House about eight years now and when I stay I feel safe and happy because my mum and dad are having a rest. If I could describe Dylan in three words, I would describe him as cheeky, full of energy um, and confident. He's made friends since he's been here and before that he was quite isolated. So. Um, we are able to provide things on many levels. I describe Helen Douglas House as my oasis because when you go through those doors, you leave all your baggage, your problems behind. And I wouldn't have got through it without them, to be honest. We can trust them, you know, with the, our child. They have loads of fun. We can like play on the PlayStation or come and do music in the music room. We are going to have a shorter life, but we and have a fun life too. So me and Nelly have bone bubbles here and that allows her to work her lung muscles and her chest muscles, giving her a good physio. We organised a family fun day in aid of Helen and Douglas House to um, specifically raise, raise money for the play area here. Over 800 people attended the, the day. Um, we had um, everybody from suppliers, contractors, family and friends attend the event and we raised over £26,000. That £26,000 being invested in play and the people who play um, is enormously, enormously important. The play area has gone from being one small room to being the absolute centre of Helen House. To meet Lily today was absolutely incredible and for Lily to explain herself how the play therapy helps um, with her condition as well, um, that really, it was incredible and it really kind of brought home what our fundraising goes towards. He wants to have a normal life, he wants to get married, he wants to have children like everybody else and um, with his positive attitude which ca came in part from all the care and support he's had from Helen Douglas House. The relationship we have with Barclay undoubtedly has an effect on the children we look after um, and longevity of relationship is really important for us because one of the things that we really need to fund is the ongoing care that we give. It's so important that this relationship continues and gets stronger every year um, so the likes of Dylan's mum have that sense of security that the funding will always be there and will continue. I think this is just potentially the start. We can get a lot bigger. We know that the support is going to be there for as long as Dylan needs it. It's why all of us do the job to give people opportunities to live their lives in the most full way that they can. He said to me when he did get diagnosed he said oh well mum I'll have to make the most of every day and that's amazing. So brave. I'm really, really proud.